The concepts of mukti and moksha itself have been so not understood. And we always separate and say spirituality has nothing to do with science. Religion has nothing to do with science. And that is the beginning of us losing the plot. Today, it's just become like a tourist spot. I, in fact, got invited once to speak on this platform about temples for tourism. And I just blatantly refused. I said, temples are not places of tourism and we need to stop projecting it as, as such. No matter how beautiful a temple, like the one in my backdrop, which is the Madurai Meenachi temple, but they are not places of mere architectural marvel or tourism. They are places that affect your physiology. Any place which is a mukshadha will affect women's menstrual cycles in very, very unpleasant ways. So when I spoke to women who'd been to Kailash, they all told me how their period shifted in very, very unpredictable ways after that. So one woman just finished her period but reached Kailash and she got it again. So in less than a week's time, she got her second period. And it's not just physically that they affect you, they also affect you emotionally because this is the path of moksha and it comes with the emotional feelings of vairagya. One woman who had been to Kailash, she described it beautifully. She said, when I returned, I found that I had completely lost interest in samsara. I didn't feel like being with family. I didn't feel like attending to those duties. So this is how these places can affect women, both physically and emotionally. And you need to really proceed with caution and you need to know what you're doing. The Hindu religion, Hindu spiritual process is all about science. It is the knowledge of the Sukshma Sharira. And we need to start bringing that back in our education system. Please remember to subscribe to us and switch on the notifications for this channel. For our other social media links, more content and to support our work, please visit citti.net.